Hey guys, Michelle Stover here, and I'm gonna to talk to you today about creating your own joy. So one of my favorite quotes by Rachel Hollis is you and only you are ultimately responsible for who you become and how happy you are. One of the things I know that gets us all down is the busyness of life. So I've got a few tips to try to maybe help create your own joy every day. The first one is get an amazing playlist because let me tell you what, my mornings are crazy, things happen. I got three boys to get ready in the morning, but as soon as we get in that van, I push play and we are jamming all the way to school. People see me at stoplights, they laugh at me in our rearview mirror because the three boys and I, we are rocking out. And it's just one thing to just get all the negativity out of your head and start your day right. I know our school safety advocate sees me bumping into the parking lot every morning and sometimes I need that extra minute of just hearing, let me clear my throat or can't stop the feeling or whatever groove I'm listening to that morning will put me in a good mood. In the middle of your day, let's say something happens at work, push pause in your day, play a good song, get up and dance, shut your office door maybe or not, um, take a walk outside and just clear your head. I'm telling you a good pay playlist is what you need. Don't underestimate the power of a good playlist. The second thing that really helps me get in a better head place is smile and say hi to people. What's the point of walking around all day with a scowl on your face and your shoulders slumped over? Guess what? Your day or your mood will never get better if you don't smile. So just try it. I mean, one thing, walking in the halls at work or at school, smile, say hi. In the grocery store, in Walmart, doesn't matter if people think you're crazy, just smile and say hi. All the time people turn around and smile back and say, hey, have a great day. So give it a whirl. I guarantee you'll feel better and you'll pass that kindness on to somebody else. You can't let a bad five minutes destroy your entire day. It's your choice, it's your mindset. Something bad happens to you, you can think, am I gonna choose joy or am I gonna let this just destroy the rest of my day and become an Eeyore? Um, another thing, think about who you surround yourself with. Let's say I wanna lose weight or I wanna run a marathon. If I surround myself with people who don't really value that or aren't gonna help me with that, all I'm gonna hear is negativity. Why do you wanna do that? Let's go get chips and salsa. Why are you even running? Why do you wanna waste your time on that? Let's go to a movie. Surround yourself with people who are like, yes, let's do that. I'll run with you. I'll go to the gym with you. Whatever you need, surround yourself with positive people who are going to push you and help you along. If you're around negative Nellies, it's hard to be positive. So find people who will cheer you on, not question your motives or what you're doing. Um, Another thing that really drains you is stop comparing yourself to other people. We live in a world of Instagram and social media where everybody is got makeup on, got filters, got good lighting. And we look at that and we compare ourselves to that and it kind of robs our joy. Like comparison of other people takes our joy away. So think about that, it'll drain you. And if you should yourself, like I should do this, I should do that, you're just gonna drain your energy. Make a list, make it happen. Surround yourself with positive people, it's your mindset. Um, you are in control of how happy you are. You can do great things. So remember this, get a good playlist. Smile and say hi. Change your mind, surround yourself with good people, create your own joy. It's up to you. Talk to you later, bye.